tell. Uh, he snuck up the street. We're gonna do some hunting. Let's go. So the first place we're gonna go today is Ollie's Discount. No, Arg Ollie's Bargain Outlet. Good stuff cheap. I've seen lots of posts about stuff being in here. This one usually doesn't have anything, but we'll go in, we'll take a look, we'll find out. Uh, let's take a look at what they have. It's kind of cool. Bluetooth interactive droid. There's so many toys. Batteries. You can hear their jacked up ceiling fan. Let's see. Nerf gun stuff. Box candy land. Warrior tech mayhem mashers. You will find some janky shit in here. But you'll find some stuff like... They've got Ninja Turtle stuff. Yeah, knocking stuff over. None of the actual turtles, but... There's a Wooden Warrior Aquaman. Does that make sense? Last kids on earth jacking some zombies. Some Stranger Things stuff. Let's look at some of the other aisles. Okay. Arcade One Up giant joysticks. 60 bucks down from 150. I'm buying one. Yep. Giant joystick of all these games. Yep. Alright. Star Wars. Random weird stuff. Hero clicks. Power trains. Rescue freight. I don't know what the hell that is. Some of those crappy Avengers toys. Butt heads. There's the Grim Ripper. Oh, and uh, Surf Flesh a lot. This side we've got games and Got some cards and some NT Warrior Mega Man cards or a Rick and Morty Total Recall card game. Which is that? $7.99. I'm dragging around this giant joystick. Hangries. I might have to stop recording just because it's going to be hard to walk around carrying this damn joystick and using my phone. But I don't see anything else here anyway. Like I said, I don't usually find much. So this was Ollie's. 
for our next stop, let's take a look at Frost. So it's pretty crowded. I'm going to do this really, really quick, but I've already found whatever these little things are is kind of cool, but they've got Marvel Legends figures and the Dune figures are 10 bucks. This is a good stop. So that Ross Hall, I'll, I'll make a video or I will add an ending to this whole thing at the end. For me, it'll be later tonight. For you guys, it'll just be during the video, but... Uh, what I just got from Ross was pretty impressive considering some of that stuff I was about to, like it's in my cart at a couple of stores, pay $25, $30 for some of this stuff and I just got it for 10 bucks. So I am really excited. That was pretty awesome. Uh, I couldn't record much. It was kind of crowded. Um, let's go to the next spot. All right, last stop for this run. Let's see what Target's got. This is gonna be the shortest one. This place is super busy. And I'm trying to not be super obvious. Oh, Eternian Goddess. I have all the rest of those. This one's nice because everything I might want to buy is all in one place. Highly recommend everybody buy that one. I have all the rest of these. These, are, these Eternals are going to go on clearance. Nobody's gonna buy them. Oh. I'll get the No Way Home Spider Man. That's cool. Nothing as far as Transformers goes, not really. You've got a couple of things. Nothing I really need right now. No Blaster. Check one more spot, but that's gonna be it for Target. All right, we've arrived at the collector's spot. Splinter's cool. Some of these Fortnite figures are kind of neat. Like that is interesting. They don't put price tags on anything. Funko Pops, some statue stuff, some Stranger Things stuff, Funko Pops, these little tenth scale dioramas, what do hide here, little backpack, Billy Eilish stuff, oh, there's it, Muck Everlasting, well, that's about it for this place. I guess if I would have bought the $10 guy, what I would have had to do was find three more of the $20 guys. But no, the movie was good, but not enough to start collecting toys from it. So I think that's gonna be about it. All right, so I guess I'm done. It's a pretty good haul between Tart Ross and, and the thing I got at dead, dead, dead. At Ollie's, uh, at least found something at Target. Um, I'll, have a, I'll add to this video, uh, so right after this break, there will be a, a full look at everything. I'll record that when I get home tonight, after the kids go to bed, because they can't see some stuff. Um, right, so that's today's toy haul.